AMPH01. This is portable handheld meter. Remove the cap and the sensor cap. Make sure the sensor cap is soaking wet always. Press power button to turn on the meter. To calibrate, remove the battery cap. Calibration of pH For calibration, there is a screwdriver provided. For pH 7, use the zero screw to adjust and for pH 4 and pH 10, use the span screw. Now dip the electrode in the standard pH 7 buffer solution. Using the zero screw, adjust the pH value on the display to the standard value. Once the value is adjusted, wash the electrode with clean water. Dip the electrode in the standard pH 4 buffer solution. Using the span screw, adjust the pH value to the standard value of the solution. Repeat the procedure for pH 10 buffer solution. Once all pH values are calibrated, we can test the samples. Dip the electrode in the sample. Stir gently for a stable reading and note the reading. To change the batteries, Note the polarities and replace the batteries. To replace the electrode, unscrew the electrode column and detach the electrode. Replace with a new electrode and screw the electrode column back. For TDS, calibration. To calibrate, dip the electrode in standard 1413 buffer solution. Stir gently for stable reading. Using span screw, adjust the reading to 1413. Once the meter is calibrated, wash the electrode. The meter is ready to test the TDS of the sample. Dip the electrode in the sample. Stir gently for stable reading. Note the reading of your sample. Conductivity. Dip the electrode in the standard 12.88 buffer solution. Stir gently for a stable reading. Use span screw to adjust the reading. Once the meter is calibrated, wash the electrode. The meter is ready to test the conductivity of the sample. Testing Dip the electrode in the sample. Stir gently for a stable reading. Note the reading. If the electrode tend to perform slow, use the sandpaper provided to polish the electrode. Use the rough side of the paper and gently polish holding perpendicular to each other. Once done, screw the electrode cap back. For better understanding of this product, please refer to the impact leaflet provided.